Hi, I'm William Kane, and I'd like to ask you to help me get an espresso machine. That is a advanced coffee machine, and I'll explain why. My first book, The Art of Kissing. I'm also a science writer. I wrote The New Testosterone Treatment with Dr. Ed Friedman. And I've written a new book about coffee. I'd like to give you a copy of this book. It has the latest information about how coffee interacts with your DNA and certain people are helped by coffee if they are a fast metabolizer of caffeine, which I am. Other people, if they're a slow metabolizer, are actually harmed. Uh, they will have more non-fatal heart attacks, so their risk will increase if they drink coffee. This is the only book that will explain how you can find out whether or not you are a fast or a slow caffeine metabolizer. And so I think this, this book would be very helpful for all people who are interested in coffee. Many writers have used coffee, including Goethe. He wrote The Sorrows of Young Werther, a fantastically beautiful novel. In fact, you can thank Goethe for discovering that caffeine is the active ingredient of coffee. William Faulkner almost always had a hot pot of coffee sitting by his writing table. It helped him write his complex novels. Ayn Rand, who wrote Atlas Shrugged, used coffee to help her write this very, very long and complex novel. And Jack Kerouac, one of my favorite writers, wrote this book, The Subterraneans, in three days using coffee. This is a terrific book, by the way. Again, I would like to give you a copy of my book entitled Coffee, which has the latest information about how you can help yourself and find out whether coffee has advantages or disadvantages. And I explain all of that in the book, and it is a very fascinating read, especially for someone who is interested in coffee. So I hope you can help me to obtain an espresso machine, and I would appreciate it greatly. And I think you're going to find the information in this book, which contributors will receive if they are of a certain level. I think you will find that information fascinating. Thank you very much, and I hope to see you someday in a coffee shop. We'll have a cup of coffee together.